Now is not the time to reminisce. We have to look forward to the future. The question is, is there a world where Gengar's, is Mega Gengar, it's weird. Mega Gengar is one of those Pokemon where like, unless it's Feline Prowess, I don't see me using it. I know that's awful to say, but it's like not even worth going to Morty. But you know who is worth going to? That's right, Claire, baby. It is absolutely worth going to Claire and getting our eighth and final gym badge. Uh, we know that Aerodactyl Lee with Stealth Rock is kind of annoying. Uh, my Tingaton can't outspeed it, so I can't actually Oko it. So the question becomes, is there a way for me to just set up in front of this Aerodactyl? We can definitely stop rocks if we want to. This, oh, she has Gouging Fire now. We could probably go, um, this might be weird, but we could go Bulk Up on Okie Dokie, which will force the Protect. And then we should just be able to go like super effective move and then mock punch. You gotta learn, you gotta learn ice punch, right? Ice punch is definitely the best punch for this gym. Uh, we don't need ice protect here. Actually, we just go return. We have refrigerate, baby. That's right, we just go return. Oh, we finally get to use this, let's go. Because I have the bulk up on this thing, our dactyl should absolutely go for taunt. And we can just go return, mock punch, we stop rocks, we feel good about it. Uh, do I want drain punch for this fight? Not really, I think I'd rather have the coverage of EQ. You don't learn EQ. Like I said, I would never wanna use EQ. Right now this thing gets walled by Magirna pretty hard, unfortunately. And ground type moves would be the only thing to be super effective against it. It's all right though, because we could always just bring Blissey for Magirna. Blissey does hard wall Magirna. You're not touching me. I'll tell you that much. You are literally not touching me. I could definitely go bone in for Roaring Moon. Like it just won't matter because I am very physically bulky and I'm pretty sure that play rough is a TM now. I'm almost positive. Yes, it is. And play rough is great in this fight. Uh, probably more so than return, right? We play rough Roaring Moon, we play rough uh, Dragon Knight, we play rough, no, then we Earthquake Nagata down, we Earthquake Gouging Fire. Yeah, so this looks pretty good. Now, you're really good for Dragonite as well, Slacking. You are really good for Dragonite. Uh, I would say though, we just go Melmetal for Dragonite. And we double Iron Bash into Ice Punch. Uh, Naganadel, we have Blissey, but let's bring a backup. I'm pretty sure that Focus Sash Paver with Dragon Darts will do the trick, because rocks will not be up. And I can't live in a world where Dragon Darts doesn't Oko. I don't even want to calc it. I just don't live in that world. I refuse. And then against the Gouging Fire, once again, Melmetal's really good. But truthfully, we should be able to just go with a, a like an adamant Gymkhana should just Oko. Only two Bonins is kind of crazy. You are wrong. Bonin stocks are going down. Uh, at this very point. Or we're gonna try it anyway. Can you get Kyurem White, Kyurem Black? If I found a Kyurem in Victory Road, I'm pretty sure we could fuse them on Cinnabar. I'm pretty sure that we could fuse them on Cinnabar. All right, let's see if this actually works. All I know is that if this Aerodactyl actually goes for Stealth Rocks, I am in trouble. I am in trouble. Let's see. A nerve. I return. Okay, you go for the taunt, perfect. I mean, this, a refrigerate return has to bring this thing to Sash. Can you get Primal Dialga or Palkia? I don't think you can change the forms of the current one we have, but we could potentially find one. Not anymore, but in a different run. I'm pretty sure they're, they're in the game, right? I don't know they're not in the game, I don't know. Straight to the gouge fire, interesting. Okay, I don't, I'm not a huge fan of that. Wouldn't I just bulk up? Isn't the correct play to just bulk up right away? You're gonna Dragon Dance, I'm gonna bulk up. You're gonna Dragon Dance, I'm gonna bulk up. Nah, it's just not even a risk of this, but we already ran the counts. Oh, I'm taunted anyway, I can't bulk up. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. I don't know how to play this game. All right, let's go out into this. Booster did not boost defense. There's no way. Oh wait, it did boost defense. Oh no. I got got by the calculator. Oh, we're losing Amon. 
We're losing him on him. I crit here, though. Uh-oh. Okay. Let's talk about this all together. He's at plus two. He still... He doesn't take out a Groudon, guys. I'm a... I'm, a, I'm literally a Groudon. He doesn't take me out. The calculator says he does not take me out. Flare Blitz is his highest... Oh, wait, hold on. That's what the, is that what the sun... That's strong winds. Flare Blitz is his highest damaging move. It does 74%. Now, here's... I'm going to take a risk. I'm going to Stealth Rock so that he goes down the Flare Blitz recoil and I just get Rocks up for free. I mean, I'm just... I'm, I'm, like, I'm locked in. I'm, I'm literally locked in. I, I, you guys are in for a treat today. You guys are in for a treat. I'm literally locked in. I'm actually locked in. Okay, Meganadel comes out, takes Rock's damage. Uh, obviously going to go for an attack here. Uh, why wouldn't it? Couple options we have, um, but I'm not going to hard swap into Paver on an attack. I'd rather go into Aldrich. Then we can Thunder Wave Teleport. Draco Meteor is not real. Draco Meteor is not real. That's a lot of damage, actually. That's some life orb damage. I'm going to T-Wave here. As you nasty plot to gain that plus two back, that's fine. I actually land the T-Wave. It's not versing patterns right now. And then the best place to teleport. Full para. Teleport out into Paver. And Dragon Dart. So you better swap into Magirna. You're pathetic. Crap, I should have seen that coming. I should have seen that coming then. Uh, we go for U-turn because I'm faster than you. My label to upload the hardcore docs. They are in the description, Dariel. They were created by Light Glory and they are real. Uh, we go out of the Aldrich here. As you shift gear, I go for another Thunder Wave. Floor Cannon comes through, does relatively nothing, and the special attack harshly falls. There's the T-Wave, and we can just Seismic Toss for free. I don't know why you're shift gearing, but you pop off. All right, we're going to get... Oh, look at that. Now, that's nice. We'll get some damage off on the Roaring Moon. Roaring Moon. Drop the G. And we have to swap because you're going to go for an attack. We go on the bone in here. I really like this sprite. Uh, that does more than I wanted it to. It doesn't matter, though. I can either bulk up. Who's left? Magirna is left, so I can't really bulk up. I could still bulk up. I should have bulked up. I wanted to bulk up. I just misclicked there. That's okay. I'm locked in. I'm literally locked in. Uh, Dragonite comes out. So... I think I have to bulk up here. You should D-dance. You do D-dance. My gut says plus one play rough does enough to take out Dragonite. Right? So I'm gonna go for it. The E speeds, that's perfect. I don't understand why you E speed when you're faster than me after D dance, but that's fine. You're cooked. Bonin is picking his nose and you're fainting to it. How does it feel, Claire? You're literally losing to a nose picker. Public nose picker, mind you. Uh, we EQ. Doesn't even try to hide it. Yo, Quack, so this is a randomizer. All of our abilities are randomized. That is why slacking no longer has truant. All right, then we just EQ. Yo, the Blissey slacking core, kind of insane. I mean, we might beat the game today. I was planning, I was planning on just getting through Victory Road today, but at this pace, at this pace, it's kind of ridiculous even in those boots. All right, eighth badge acquired the TM for Draco Meteor. 100 beast bowels. Level cap is increased to 82. And it's time for us to fight our rival. AKA chat. Let's see, we chose Charmander, so you chose Squirtle. That's right, reversing the Blastoise team. 
Blastoise, Staraptor, Intimidate. Interesting. So we want to lead with something special. Or we want to just get rocks up. Rocks are really good in this fight. Really, really good. I probably go defensive Groudon with Stealth Rocks because they're just really good in this fight. So we lead this, we click Stealth Rock, and we just go for we, we just go for multiple hits. I actually think I'm supposed to put return on this over rock slide. Which I know is a weird move to see on a Groudon, but he loves me so much. Return of Azumarill, our savior. Listen, our Azumarill, rest in peace, man. Azumarill, I was literally gassing Azumarill up at the gym this morning to random gym goers. I'm like, bro, you should have seen my Azumarill against Giovanni 3 yesterday. And they were like, who the heck are you talking to? That was a little weird. Got a little steamy in the sauna, but it's fine. Is this why Chad is your only friend? That's toxic and yes. So King Gambit, a physical wall. Uh, we can go, we can go bulk up, bulk up Bonin. EQ is fine. EQ is good, EQ is good. We probably get rid of Play Rough for this one and we go with Return again. Uh, Iron Moth with Fiery Dance, Sludge Wave, Energy Ball, Dazzling Gleam. Guess who walls you? Kind of in a weird way, Mr. Cat. I turn off the Fiery Dance, which is like the most important thing because you're not getting stronger. And then I'm not weak to anything you do. Probably go with Salt Vest though. Eh, I shouldn't need it. You are very, very strong. I feel like I do. I feel like I do go assault vest. Uh, that is our iron moth. Then for the Azumarill, I would say Palkia for the Storm Drain, but honestly, no. Azumarill's an annoying Pokemon, man. It's honestly, it's honestly annoying for my team. If Slacking wasn't already being used, I would say let's just use Slacking. Could go Bone in, right, with a Poison Jab. Slacking would do great if I wasn't using it already. Or King Gambit, but King Gambit is really scary. I could use, I could swap these two and use Bonin for King Gambit. I guess that is the best play because then we can also relearn uh, Poison Jab over Return because Return does nothing for this fight. Uh, Sneasler, we need a physical wall that is not weak to fighting, preferably. You kind of, Jellison kind of walls it for actual days. I do resist both stab. We'll, we'll bust out the jelly, dude. I think the jelly bust out is time. We're gonna go not negative defense. That's literally the opposite of what I want on you, Ryodrix. I will go bold. I will give you some leftovers. Nice apple core from last night's snacks. That is gonna be our team for rival battle number one against chat. Everyone say team. Uh, slacking. All right. Our team is relatively unchained. The, changed. the only thing we have now is a Jellicent. Uh, Blissey, Melmetal, Okidoki. Slack and Groudon, yeah. Relatively unchanged. We're kind of sitting. Morning, Alex. Don't tell my wife. <clears throat> I'm convinced Parental Bond Blissey is best Blissey. That doesn't make Seismic Toss hit twice, does it? There's no way... There's no way Seismic Toss hits twice. There's no way Seismic Toss hits twice. What do you charge beam then? What do you do with parental bond? It does? Does it do 50 each? Does it do your level each time or does it get cut in half? You can't use multiple type codes in a run? Oh man, I thought you could. That really stinks. That really, really stinks. Uh, I think that randomize is always more fun, but it's totally... There's no wrong way to do it, Mario. All right, I got my lefties. We can go for a return here. It's our strongest move we can do, but we have been intimidated. Ooh. I didn't expect all of that. I probably needed to run protect on this thing, man. Uh, if you're going to Brave Bird, let's go... Going to Mr. Cat or Bonin. Nah, I'm slower. Alright, let's go to Mr. Cat. We the Bree Bird. Okay, no problem. Now, a close combat is kind of a problem. I could go out into Bonin on the close combat, because I'm very bulky. 
And then I can mock punch. Because you'll have lower defenses. Why no Jellicent? Because then Jellicent just has to dig a Brave Bird anyway, and that kind of defeats the purpose. I could have just gone into Jellicent frame one instead of going out into our Melmetal. I think this was the best scenario where, like, look, Bonin's gonna be at full health. Thanks to lefties. No harm, no foul. We just couldn't switch into Bonin on a Brave Bird, you know? All right, Sneezler comes out, kind of scary. What? What do you do to me? I think you just U-turn. This looks like super bait. I'm gonna Drain Punch. What? He's just throwing his Sneasler in the dumpster, dude. I would've bulked up. I might bulk up now. Wait, can I sweep? Nothing from the Iron Moth hits me for super effective, and it's pretty pathetic. It's a pretty pathetic Mon. Oh, no way you're going for status. Brother. Now nah, he doesn't get those. It's fine. He doesn't, he doesn't get those statuses. It's fine. Oh, boy. It's fine. He's doing nothing. Sleep is actually better than Para. Like, I'd rather him put me to sleep. Okay, well, I didn't I didn't mean, like, right away again. I'm actually gaining HP, by the way. No sleep. Okay. All right, that should be enough, right? I'm going to Drain Punch here. Oh, I should have Mock Punch. Yeah, I deserve that. Oh, I woke up turn one! He can't Poison Bone in, though. Okay, this should be fine. I mean, Drain Punch, I'm at plus 97 and a half. Nah, I eat this. Right, guys? Okay. I was actually, I peed a little. Might have to take a quick break after this. I was a little nervous there. Not gonna lie. Okay. That was your best bet, huh? Iron Moth. You are faster than me. Mock Punch might actually just take you out. Ah! One more bulk up, dude. One more bulk up. I should have just gone for Drain Punch, huh? It's all right, because the rest of the mons are physical. And even with your Chopple, you are not hanging on to this. I don't care about your Overlord and how supreme it is. I don't care. I do not care. Yo, what's going on, Norblaze? You're gone. You're cooked. Bro, the Sleeper Bonin. This is one of our first catches, and even in the latest battles of the game, it is just so good. It is so unbelievably good. Guess what I have for you, my friend? Cooked. Actually cooked. Insane. Okie dokie is cracked out of its mind. <clears throat> All right, we got to, you know what we could do? Well, no, we have to prep now. We do have to prep now for Brennan. Because there's no, uh, there's no Pokemon Center over there as far as I know. Deoxys attack with Focus Sash. Do we want Stealth Rocks for this fight? This fight is very switch heavy, but there's nothing that like, there's no Focus Sash. There's nothing crazy. Let's see. Do we go Fake Out into, I'm not weak to anything you do, so I can just go for a move? I know I want to bring you to this fight because you have Sap Sipper. Is there a way for me to sweep here? Because now I realize we want to bring this with an air balloon, and this is just a perfect answer for Sceptile. I love how much 
Ice Beast Wall Sceptile. The only special attacker is going to be Landers, so we can bring Blissey for Landers. From Yo, Steffi, come on, also that puts you on the list. To watch your fire emblem engage play through Yo. I realized I never watched it. Okay, how'd you like Any it? Any chance you'll ever do another fire emblem playthrough on the website? Uh, Would there's definitely, it's it. definitely not off, it's definitely not off table. I've decided I'm not doing rocks, so let's just do this a bit more traditional, so to speak. I could probably go fake out Scrafty to break the sash and then take one hit and Oko with Crunch, right? I definitely want Ice Punch on you. In this battle, it's much better to have Ice Punch than uh, Thunder Punch. Let's do a little Chapel Berry on our Scrafty. That way we can survive. And cr fake out Crunch will Oko for sure. That'll take you out, no problem. Uh, Jirachi with Iron Head U-Turn Thunder Punch. Do I need Drain Punch for this fight? It's good against the Huntail, but I'm not really going to be able to take on the Huntail if it clicks Shell Smash. So I think that we just go Protect. Now for Jirachi, what can swap into a, let's say, well, actually, I think that Melmetal is really good against Jirachi. You're here for Landorus. Uh, we can't Thunder Wave you. So that's kind of annoying. So I actually am going to run Toxic for the first time. I'm going to run Toxic over Thunder Wave for the first time. Uh, then we need a great physical wall for Huntail. His name is Bonin. And the name of the game is going to be Play Rough over EQ. Zapdos Galarian, right? So something that can eat hits. That's most likely going to be Mr. Cat. Although Mr. Cat doesn't... Yeah, I think the, the combination of Mr. Cat and having our Ghost-type Jealous in here is probably what we need. Uh, we could also go with... Focus Sash Favor, right? I think that's fine. So many Monza are gonna be baiting the close combat that literally, I mean, everyone literally is. The Dragapult should be able to come in and just click Dragon Darts for free. There's no Fairy types on the side of the board ever. So we could just do that. Uh, and that is our team. That is indeed our team. We do have one Dex Nav for Victory Road, yes. Because we beat Claire and we have not used that Dex Nav yet. So it is the final Dex Nav of the run for the final wild encounter of the run. Here we go. Yes, so the pill and patch works now, Shadow Ninja. It does work on 4.1. Alright, Deoxys is here. Let's see how much this fake out does. There's pressure. We go fake out. Big damage. We click crunch. He's going superpower. So let's see if we needed the chopper. If this does less than half, we didn't need the chopper. Okay, we needed the chopper. We needed the chopper. I did take my medication. Thank you. I'm, I'm dead. Thank you. Thank you. Darth, did I miss your super chat? I'm sorry. Uh, are you excited for Monday? The shadiest of days. Not sure if you'll be able to see the eclipse. Oh, the you're right. Thank you for the super chat. I really appreciate it, my dude. Over Steph, thank you for the super chat as well. Fake out the deal, then switch to Dragapult and so Oh, that would have been top tier. You're popping off. I'm afraid of the eclipse, man. We're actually taking picking up. I'm not afraid, but we're picking up Abby early from school because of the eclipse. Um wait, is this really my answer? This is not good prep. I could have literally just gone to Zekrom. Like, yeah, I'm weak to Ice Fang, but... I think I'm supposed to bulk up here. Because Play Rough's not going to Oko you. I've been in this, like, exact scenario before. The only way Play Rough Oko's you is if, um... Oh, you do... Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is if you Shell Smash again. Which you will because you're pathetic. Which you will because it's pathetic.
Yeah, if he didn't Shell Smash again, he survives that. But he had to Shell Smash because he didn't see that I KO'd him. All right, I don't have Protect here. But you, like, don't, you do not hit me. Like, you don't, I mean, you Serene Grace me, to be fair. And I do flinch. Okay, well, that's annoying. I actually probably take this. Five dollars from Toxic Flyer. Hi, Shady. Hey, Toxic. Too here. Hey, what's up? So I heard my Mega was balked, huh? Would have yeah. been nice to be self-sufficient instead of listening okay, to well, my that's trainer. Toxic. I mean, I definitely tank this. There's like no reason to switch out. Any Brave Birds anyway? Wow, if I would have swapped into Paver, I would have been in trouble. That's crazy. I would have been I would have been in big trouble. I have no idea why the AI chose to do that, but it did. And here we are. Alright, now this thing unfortunately hit specially, so we do have to swap here anyway. Uh this is Aura Sphere, right? On Aldrich. I click toxic. Oh, you have Rock Slide. Oh, no. Um. No, I could do this. 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 Let's go out into Ghost Rider on the Rock Slide. That way we can fake out. Chippies. It took an hour for you to get the notification. See, like, I, dude, I even asked chat. Some chatters got their notification early today, but that's crazy. Orosphere. Poison? Done. Cooked. Like a professional. Like a professional. Alright, I already protected, so I can't protect again, but I can go out of the bone in here. Alright, my gut says you just swap, so I'm actually just gonna click play rough. <laughs> That's embarrassing for you, man. That's embarrassing for you, man! Okay, you just barely hang on. Let's calm down. Uh, I really want to go out of the tank. Even though I don't need to. I, 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 mean, I prepped this tank for this reason. Scale shot doesn't affect me. You have to switch here, right? Okay, or you sword stance for, for posterity, I guess. I'm not sure. Uh, then we go out of the bone in here as you iron head. And uh, I'm not running EQ. What's my real answer for you? Is it Mr. Cat? It is Mr. Cat, right? Let's Thunder Wave. Let's Thunder Wave. Let's EQ. EQ. All right, Brandon, you are cooked, and here we are. The level cap increases again. Are we now at 85? We are. We are at the final level cap of the game. Victory Road. Let's make sure Infinite Repel is on. And let's see if there's anything good on this floor. is a Metagross. And we could actually use a Mega Metagross. Hold on. All right, the only thing would be Flying Armor. We already have a lot of dragons. Um, I know I still have my Master Ball. This is where we use it. So let's, let's scout. Yo, Cardinal! Cardinal with the 20 gifted. Top bomb of the day, no questions. Thank you so much, Cardinal, for your support. I appreciate it a ton. Are there any Dodgers? As of right now, Matang is the clear... Wait, I don't have strength yet. Come on, I forgot to give this old man his teeth. This poor guy. For who knows how long now. He's just been struggling to chew. Living off mashed potatoes. We have to wait till we get to the other floor, right? We have to see the other floor before we secure Matang. Because there really could be... There could be some good stuff. All right, we have to, we do have victory road battles, which I shouldn't have to crazy prep for, but we do indeed need to prep. So we have Moss Hold here, population bomb and speed up. So, so, so here's the thing. This is an annoying Pokemon to say the least. I think that we could just go bone in. I'm fine with just clicking return against the Absol. Honestly, overplay rough. His return will also hit the Veluza and the Galvantula, whereas Play Rough will not hit the Galvantula as strong as return will. Okay, Slacking should just lead the way here. We'll do some soft prep against the rest of this. We can go 
Uh, Mel Metal for Shedinja, or even Mel Metal for um, Absol is really good. It's a nice physical wall. For Shedinja, we can technically go Scrafty. Not really too worried about it. Galvantula, we can go Blissey. Veluza will be slacking. I kind of want Sucker Punch. I kind of want Sucker Punch. So if he goes Filet away, I can't Sucker Punch you, right? That's true. A okay, knockoff is a TM now, right? Because knockoff would just be better than Fire Punch for this fight. Okay, we go knockoff over Fire Punch for sure. You know what? Let's be smart for Veluza. Let's bring our Zekrom. So Filet away won't even matter. You could go Rocky Helmet. I actually don't have the Rocky Helmet. And truthfully, I should get the Rocky Helmet in this run. I absolutely should get the Rocky Helmet. Yo, Zod, thanks for the 499. cents from Zod. Lurkers, drop your Mandus. All right, here we go. We just go, uh, we just go return. There's the pop bomb. It does 10. So it does at most 100. I should have kept lefties. Exactly, Nikhil, you're not wrong. Thank you for the two months. You're not wrong. Yes, triage is in Rad Red, Nicholas. All right, here's what I do. We take advantage of this, and I just bulk up. Because you can't crit enough. Right? You did crit a little bit there. Don't get it twisted. All right, and now we should be good to sweep. Now we should, yo Toma, thank you for the one gifted, I appreciate that. Oh, I'm not faster than you, I can't sweep anyway. Like you, you, you borderline Okome. There's the thunder. Oh, you're gonna swap into Shedinja every time. You didn't. I literally don't know how to play Pokemon. Uh, let's go out into Flyer. Go on to Aldrich. From Avanzara. Payday tomorrow, so toxic. here's my Mando. Okay, Cheers for toxic. all the top content, Father. That's toxic, dude. Hey, thank you so much, Evan, Evan Sarah. I appreciate that a ton. Right, he's playing away, but the unaware says $4. I don't care and what you say. Cents from Victor da Silva. Mando. Thank you, Victor. I inherited all my parents' debt and am hiding from the IRS. What? Here is my man. Wait, is that a real thing? Do you inherit your parents' debt? If so, that is the worst thing that I've ever heard in my life. Do you actually inherit your... There's no way. There's no way. There's no way that's how the world works. I just refuse to believe that. All right, shouldn't just holding on for dear life. Uh, I always said to go into the Ghost Rider here because I don't want my Zekron to be burned in this fight. Let's crunch it up. Take out the Shedinja. Uh This is play rough every single day of the week. You can't inherit that. Okay, good. I was going to say, this that's just, that's the most insane thing I've ever heard. We double Iron Bash here as you Night Slash me. It's pathetic. If it's Mafia debt you inherited? All right, that's fair. Google says it's repaid by the estate. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. I was going to say, that is the worst thing. Imagine, like, lo I'd, wa I'd want a patch update immediately. I'd have to talk to the, the engineer of this whole thing. This is, that would just be insane. All right, now we could just go Seismic Toss. I probably should have Toxic first, actually. For the BM. There it is. All right, easy first battle. Never worried.